Hello everyone, my name is Xu. Today we are going to introduce an interesting solar water purifier with enhanced solar absorption, heat retaining and salt oil resistance. As we know, water scarcity is a consistent worldwide problem. People are always searching an efficient way to get fresh water. Especially for those countries where naturally lack of fresh water, or, the, or those people who need fresh water under an emergency condition. Until now, common and useful method for getting drinkable water from polluted water or even sea water are mainly focused on filtration, multi-stage fresh evaporation, reverse osmosis, and solar distillation. As the most inexpensive and low carbon way to acquire fresh water, solar water distillation is doubtlessly a best selection. But the conventional solar water purifiers are still limited by some construction shortages, such as heat loss due to the heat transferred from gas liquid interface to water, fabrication without the possibility of large scale, low resistance to salt or oil pollution. In addition, the solar water purifier needs to adapt to some complex situation during the actual usage, especially the problem of oil pollution in all kinds of waters caused by like petroleum e exploitation or sea transportation. So the improved solar distillation based on conventional one may have more advantages such as the stable floating to fix the heat energy at gas liquid interface to provide a higher temperature. Also feasible large-scale fabrication and robust resistance to salt and oil pollution. So under these situations, an improved organohydrogen solar water purifier is obtained from view of above requirements. Finally, the organic gel phase dispersed into PVA hydrogel to be local heat production point with low heat diffusion or loss, as well as the low density organic gel made a photable solar purifier to quickly evaporate liquid water to vapor. And also hydrophilic PVA hydrogel improved the water transportation from bottom to surface. For the extra improvement, hydrophilic PVA hydrogel also improved the resistance ability to oil pollution bilateral capillary action. Each part of improvements is designed as a prospection. So now let's see the improved performance in the extra usage. Firstly, due to the suitable but still low density evaporator, it can stably float as the interface of gas and liquid. It can provide the maximum efficiency to transfer water to water gas then evaporate it by relying its hydrophilic property as well. Also due to the hydrophilic property, the lifted evaporator at the gas liquid interface can resist oil by lateral capillary action, as the above images demonstrated. In addition, from the absorption spectrum patterns, the evaporator Adopted by CNT provided a high light absorption more than 90% and the low heat conductivity fixed the heat at surface in extra test to reduce the heat diffusion to keep a higher temperature to efficiently evaporate absorbed water. Finally, based on this design, the fresh water yield on this improved solar water purifier is better than conventional purifier which produce more drinkable water even with a stability after 240 hours under one standard sun. When the evaporator performed under natural sun, the performance of water purifying can be kept with the same utilized stability more than 240 hours. Meanwhile, the improved evaporator can also resist the salt crystal crystallization when it, pu when it purifies sea waters to fresh water, and the final fresh water totally reached to the standard form from WHO. This design provides a promising pathway towards to scaled clean water production in water deficient or wild areas. Prospectively, the design 
thought also could be extended to other complicated polluted waters. Very thanks for your listening.